take our lead, let's help you make your mark. Our goal is your satisfaction. Let us show you the way. A 2014 study of college tennis players determined that grunting could indeed increase the power of players' ground strokes and serves. In that study, participants watched videos of a tennis player striking the ball while a loud, grunt-like yell played or did not. Take our lead. Having previously tested this idea in the past along with several teammates, there appears to be a consistent 1 to 2 miles per hour bump in velocity from grunting among already hard throwers. In all cases, there were about 6 of us who tried it, the 2 to 3 grunting fastballs we mixed in were the hardest pitches of the outings. Take our lead. Researchers believe that primitive vocalizations trigger the fight or flight response to recruit more muscle fibers as you lift. By grunting, you're essentially channeling your inner animal, which helps you move more weight. When you activate it, your deep core muscles also turn on, making you more stable. Make your mark, take our lead. Arent, of a pig, to make a low, rough noise, the pigs were grunting contentedly as they ate their food. Of a person, to make a short, low sound instead of speaking, usually because of anger or pain, he hauled himself over the wall, grunting with the effort. Take our lead. By grunting, you're essentially channeling your inner animal, which helps you move more weight. In fact, a Drexel University study found that grunting instead of regular breathing can boost maximum static hand grip strength by as much as 25%. Make your mark, take our lead. Why do people grunt? It turns out there's science behind our grunting sounds. When people do weightlifting exercises, like deadlifts and squats, they often grunt because they need to exhale, Petamonti said. The trainer explained that when people lift heavy weights, it's important they don't hold their breath. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and hit the bell notification.